Hello, welcome to another knickknack chit chat. Today we are talking about balloons. I love balloons. I never run a session without some close by. And why wouldn't you? They're colorful, they're fun. There's so many ways that you can utilize these in therapy and in play. So once a child has chosen a balloon, we'll normally start with some stretching. This helps the balloon and also resistance, proprioception, am I right? Next, we're going to blow the balloon up. This is a really great part because um, there's so many ways that you can incorporate speech and language goals into this. We've got key sign, go, stop, more. We've got big and small, colors, my turn. There's so many pieces of language that we can work on while we're doing something as simple as blowing up a balloon and the kids excitement as it gets bigger and bigger is really tangible um, so once we've got our balloon nice and big we take it off and from here we can either choose to bounce it we can tie it up and throw it or my favorite we hold the balloon and then we let it fly keep playing and see you next time